Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Sophie Society. Thanks so much for clicking on this video. And for today, I'm going to be doing, since it's the month of February and Valentine's Day is coming up, or Galentine's Day, which I actually just got done filming this look, which you should be able to click on the screen and check out. Anyways, I wanted to do an affordable perfume, just some suggestions that you guys can go purchase if you want to smell good for your loved one on Valentine's Day or for your friends. But once again, these are all affordable as I know, you know, no tea, no shade. Social media, YouTube, you know, has a thing of showing great luxury items, but to keep it a buck, not everyone can afford $300, hell, even $100 perfume. So I decided to make a video showing how you can, and these perfumes still last like a good amount of time. They still smell bomb, like they're very fragrant. So let's get into the video. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go from the sweetest smelling perfumes all the way down to like if you're into more of a muskier scent, musky, not musty. So um, the number one, the sweetest perfume that I have or that is probably on the market, y'all, no other than the Prada Candy Perfume. And this smells so good. When it comes down to perfume, my taste is sweet smells. I like the sweetness, not really the other scents. But this is, like I said, the Prada Candy Perfume. It smells so good. It's super duper sweet. And uh, the price of this is $126. And this will last you a really long time. This is 2.7 ounces, like I said, for $126. And now they got the whole afterpay trial, so you can pay four payments of $31, and you'll be good, okay? So this is the first perfume. Bloop. Second perfume in the sweet category. Y'all, this is a new perfume that I found, and I didn't even know that Laura Mercier made perfume, made fragrances, but here it is, y'all. This particular perfume uh, by Laura Mercier is the Ambre Vanille, so amber and vanilla basically. And this is $70 even, and you can get it at Sephora. To me, this smells very, like it says, vanilla. If you like a sweet, but not too, too, too sweet, this will get you right. But it also has like a warm kind of scent in it too. And it says that it has notes of bourbon, so that makes perfect sense. Vanilla notes, including vanilla orchid, vanilla liqueur bourbon vanilla vanilla musk so yeah perfect uh description vanilla and bourbon liquor and musk so it's like a very warm 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 tone i wouldn't really wear this in the summer or spring but definitely in the winter and fall okay this is very nice scent especially valentine's day coming up like i said it is 70 zoilas okay Okay, and the third perfume, which is, if you guys watched my previous vlog, you'll see I recently got the Ariana Grande Cloud Perfume, because it's been hyped up on TikTok, y'all. I fell into the little scheme. But this smells really nice, and it's not too sweet, but it's not like a stinking musk um, grandma scent either. It's very light to me, hence the name Cloud. And I will say that I sprayed this yesterday around like 12 o'clock on me and I still smelled it like around 8 o'clock so it does last a while. This will run you about $44 for the one ounce bottle. Scent type is warm and sweet, that's what it says. The notes, the top note is lavender, pear, and bergamot. The middle notes, coconut, praline, vanilla orchid, and the base is cashmere. I do get cashmere from this, but like I said, it's not too heavy. It's just very light and like fluffy. So I feel like this could be a good everyday scent, actually. Now this here is a different scent. I actually found this at Target um, during this summer. And this to me is also more of an everyday scent. This isn't sweet or musky. This is like a very, like it says, this is from the brand Good Chemistry and it's clean and practical with a bit of wit. It's very clean, I can't explain it. Like I would spray this in my bathroom. <laughs> it's very clean and very crisp. It says the main of course is fresh, spicy, citrus, vanilla, fresh, warm, spicy. So, and this is about $24. You can get it at Target or on Amazon. Oh, I also wanted to add, this is almost like a unisex smell to me. That's why I think I'm saying bathroom. Like a man or a woman can wear this, so. Yeah, good chemistry. Okay, and next we have from the brand Philosophy. This is the Amazing Grace Ballet Rose um, perfume. And this is $62 at Sephora. So this to me is very, very 
floral and I don't really like floral that much like this legit smells like a flower a rose let's get into the notes the top notes lychee cassie flower middle notes dewy peony jasmine petals rose absolute base notes ambre seeds wood and ballet pink musk and as y'all know from all that I just read about eight flowers so that like I said this is very very floral but I really like it because the packaging because it's like a tinted pink and I love pink but yeah like I said this will run you a good 62 dollars for a two ounce which is what this is and um, but it's very very floral but yet if, if you're into flowers and floral scents and this will be perfect for you it's affordable the scent will definitely last all day but it's not too overpowering and yeah and the last perfume that I have for you, we have one of the more popular ones, one of the more expensive ones in this little collection. This is the um, by Dior. It's Jador. Dior, as the commercial does. But um, this is for a 3.4 ounce bottle. It is $135. And um, I'll have to say, I ain't even gonna hold you. This is not my cup of tea. This was a gift to me. This was gifted to me. And as y'all can see, it's very much full because this is very, very, very grandma. I mean, if this is your kind of thing, like my sister will wear this kind of stuff. But I don't like really strong, I guess people would call it mature scents. I like sweeter, more immature scents, I guess. I don't know. But this smells very much First Baptist, giving very much First Lady of the Union. It's, ugh, uh, -uh. this ain't it for me. But let me tell you guys the notes in case this is your thing. The description is exotic floral fruity notes of yang yang or lang lang. Jasmine and Indian jasmine, seductive, warm. So I mean, yeah, it's very strong, very musk. But if you are, like I said, into more of a mature scent, this is the perfume for you, $135. If you got the little app page, uh, which I love, then you can break it down into four payments. Definitely First Baptist. So yeah, those were all the perfumes. Um, if you guys want to still smell good but not break the bank, this is an affordable, smelling good perfume haul collection, whatever, getting you ready for Valentine or Galentine's Day. And I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to subscribe to my Chanel. Comment down below and I will see you guys in my next video. Hi.